with the ebb and flow of the ocean, cyclical rhythms of life in the bustling pilgrim center Puri, in the state of Orissa on the eastern coast of India, goes on pirouetting in one way or the other around the Lord of the Universe, Jagannath. The word Jagannath, which means mammoth, is derived from this deity, and the car festival or Rathayatra is nothing short of being mind-blowing, a phrase used for the lack of a better one. The Ratha carries the deities of Jagannath, Balabhadra and Subhadra, each year traversing the white car street. Situated on this very street is the Akshaya Patra kitchen, that provides midday meals to the underprivileged children. As life stirs in this holy town in the wee hours of morn, the rhythms of life can be seen as various people go about their businesses, eking out their existence. The multitude of hawkers who set up their merchandise, the artists who utilize their talent in picturizing the Lord. Utkal, the ancient name of Orissa, which means a place where art and crafts have reached its stage of excellence, is renowned for stone sculpture, palm leaf paintings and patta paintings. But while the artists scurry about their activity, their lifestyle is languid, if not desolate. For many, a hard day's work is often not enough to provide for their family. For New Day Orissa to keep up its cultural tradition, we need its children to be strong and able. It is no small wonder that the people of Utkal or Orissa have opened their arms wide, welcoming Akshaya Patra. Akshaya Patra is a beacon of hope for the next generation. Akshaya Patra is a secular program that provides midday meals to government school children with the primary objective of combating the problem of malnutrition. Of the many benefits of the midday meal program is a dramatic impact on school participation of children. अखेर पत्रों यही विद्यालयों को खाद्य दवा परोठरु पिलामानंकरो खाईवा प्रति आग्रह बढ़ी ची एवं विद्यालय मध्यो छात्रों पुस्तानों पूर्वों पे क्या बुद्धि पाऊँ ची Increased attention spans and interest to attend school have in more ways than one contributed to the development of the child. Actually, I was advised by the Honorable CM to go and study the Akshay Patra Foundation model in Bangalore. And I saw the hygiene, the sanitation, and the devotion of the people working in the organization, and the food that was being served to the children. On the next day, I went also to some of the schools in Bangalore. So when I saw all those things, I had just no second opinion that we must invite Akshay Patra Foundation to come to Odisha and start this program in Odisha as well. This is the Akshay Patra kitchen, where midday meal preparations 
begin early in the morning. Rice is a staple food in Orissa. Steam is used to cook food and proves to be cost effective to cook such huge quantities. Dalma is a popular accompaniment with rice in Orissa. The choice of vegetables added to the lentils varies every day. A whole meal in itself, dalma has a variety of diced vegetables. Preparation of rice in these huge cauldrons usually takes about 15 to 20 minutes. Once cooked, the water is drained out by opening a vent at the bottom of the cauldron. Cooked rice is then tipped into stainless steel containers. As in any Indian preparation, seasoning is what makes all the difference to the palate, adding zing to the dal. Huge custom-made cauldrons can cook rice for 600 children at a time. Like a well-oiled machine, the operation to cook and distribution of food takes place without a hitch. Custom-built vehicles then transport the food to various schools in and around Puri. Okhapatra Foundation Odisha ka kam kare apne hame chahe lo eth pe je Odisha sarkar ko tarapru jo middle middle school le diya jauchi se jo parimana ro paisa hame school le khurcha koruchu Okhapatra Foundation tarthu adhika paisa khurcha kare evang susum khadyo evang hygienic condition ne neke school le pila man ko dey parchanti. The people of Puri are glad that today's meal, provided by Akshaya Patra, goes a long way to fortify their children. Akshaya Patra aims towards a world in which all children can grow, learn, and flourish, developing into healthy, active and caring members of society.